So to add to the brake video, yeah, the back ones needed replacement too. Just a little bit. What you want to do is you want to get these pins, these slide pins out of here. What you want to use is a punch, preferably, in a pinch. A nail will work. And that's what I'll probably be using right now. Now that you took the one pin out, the spring here will pop off. That can just come out whenever uh, you get the next pin out. But uh, I'll show you later how that goes whenever we put them back together. Now that you got the pins out, now the pads are just sitting right there. So all you have to do is use something to pry them out with. I'm using the pin that came out to kind of help pry them off. And first one is out, and the second one, I'm... and they're out. I think we got the money's worth out of those. There's the other one. Since this piston, I think maybe a little sees what I'm going to do. I'm going to open the valve here, the brake bleeder that uses a nine millimeter, and. I'm going to use that to my advantage so I can get old fluid out and make it easier to compress the piston. Using the brake pad against the piston, sliding it in there, I use this as leverage to push the piston back. As an example, I'm using this and the piston is sliding back. Now that the pistons are compressed, Go ahead and slide in the pads one by one. What you may have to do is compress one side to slide the pin, the pad in, then compress the other slide, the other side to secure that pad in, and then slide in the other. You want to slide them in far enough to make sure that whenever you put the pin in, that it goes through both of the ears of the the uh, pad. Next thing you want to slide the bottom pin in first with the spring in this orientation, as you see, and then hold down the spring and slide in the top pin so that both of them go to this point. The next step after that would be to hammer in both of the pins so they're locked into place. With that done, the pins should end up looking like this. Where that side is sunken in and this side is sticking out, once it looks like that, you are done and good to go.